Mutoro said this when he visited the Onderombapa Army News Aranos Road to assess the progress made. And I've already taken it up with the leadership of the roads authority that the, 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 the maintenance, not only of that road, but the maintenance in terms of graveling, regraveling, grading of roads generally in Omaheke region is not what it is supposed to be. And therefore, using this platform, I would like to encourage the roads authority. I understand in terms of the organizational setup, Mr. Mokatu is here, he's the area manager. But uh, the regional manager responsible for Maheke region and uh, Osuzonjupa region, probably other regions too, sits in Vintuk. I have already stated that the coordination should be improved. I'm not blaming Mokatu, but the regional manager must be visible. If you are based in, 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 in Vintuk or wherever, ideally the regional manager must be based in the region. But we still have some problems at that level, maybe funding, but I don't justify it. The regional manager must be in the region. Jonas Shikongo, Deputy Executive Director in the Ministry of Works and Transport, assured that government has also secured funds to complete the construction of Khobabe's Army News Road this financial year. We have received a request of about uh, $357 million for this road from uh, uh, Khobabe's through Andrombapa Army News Naranos. That was against a ceiling of about 157 million, which was indicated that this government might be able to provide. That, of course, gave us a shortfall of about 200 million. And that is the request that we have uh, submitted to say, well, there is a, a shortfall of about 200 million. And as we all know, it's a process until we get to the final budgetary uh, allocations. So just indicate that, yes, there are budgetary provision made, the project will be able to continue, the contractor will be paid, and uh, the intention is for the project to reach up to um, Aranos, as the Honorable Minister indicated. Yes. Army News Constituency Councillor Peter Kadongominya welcomes the construction of more roads in Omaheke region. I appreciate that there should be challenges, and challenges are always there to be overcome. And as the contractor have put it now, that now everything is still there, and you can request whatever you request and you get whatever you get from our central government, as long the the plan is we'll finish the road at the end of the day. That is the encouragement that we have and that is what we want. How long it will take and at the end of the ultimately it will be done.